the seventh race, 2005 Breeders' Crown Mare's Trot Championship. They are off and trotting, and what a flying start for Snazzy Millie, the best gate speed. House that Ruth built, firing up on the outside. Windy Lane Hanover is positioned third as they move past us for the first time, and Peaceful Way follows the speed off from fourth. Ecstatic is fifth. Southwind Sasha third from last, and the trailing pair will be Brahma Soul and Mystical Sunshine. So at the quarter pull, cut loose to lead it, was House that Ruth built by Brian Sears, and Snazzy Millie landed second. Windy Lane Hanover is third, and Peaceful Way is into her stride well from Fourth to 27 and 3, the opening marker, John Campbell, right lines, Windy Lane Hanover. Windy Lane Hanover is up to overtake House That Ruth built for the lead on the way to the half. Snazzy Millie back along the inside is third. Two more likes to Peaceful Way, laying off those leaders from fourth. Ecstatic is fifth in line. Still third from last, Southwind Sasha, Brahma Soul, and Mystical Sunshine, the trailers. Windy Lane Hanover made the lead. There goes Peaceful Way out of fourth. 56 seconds was the half. Peaceful Way with an explosive burst out of fourth. She's on the lead on the final turn in a breathtaking five or ten strides, taking over from Windy Lane Hanover. Now three-eighths of a mile to go in the 2005 Breeders' Crown and Ecstatic has made the outside sacrifice from third. House that Ruth filled now, hemmed up in there from fourth. Snezzy Millie is fifth. Starting widest is Mystical Sunshine. Second to last in the backfield, Southwind Sasha, and the trailer was Brahma Soul. Peaceful way at the top of the stretch in one 124 and 4, and they turn down the lane in the 2005 Breeders' Crown Mystical Sunshine. Now, second on the outside. Back along the inside is Windy Lane Hanover. It's the electrifying Peaceful Way. Peaceful Way is going to get her due. She's got two through the stretch, and she has won the 2005 Breeders' Crown Canada's Little Peaceful Way in 153 and 1 over Mystical Sunshine and House That Ruth Built. I hear just chit-chatting about Peaceful Way and uh, all of her great exploits. However, this is one race that seemed to foil her year after year. As a two-year-old, as a three-year-old, well, she answered the critics here tonight in a big way, silencing them. Yeah, you know, I'm speechless right now. It's, uh, it's probably the most nervous I've been watching a race. And, uh, you know, I guess just because that race has eluded us two years in a row. And, uh, you know, it's eluded me. I've had some chances before, but, uh, you know, Trevor did a great job, you know, he was patient and, uh, you know, she just, she's a great horse and uh, amazing, uh, just an amazing mare. Dave, she was a month away after her win in the Classic Oaks final. Uh, did that work to her advantage realistically? Um, yes, I think. Uh, that was, we, we managed her quite well and, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> I'm just, uh, she came into the race fresh and healthy, so uh, now that this race is over, we can look forward to the, hopefully the Maple Leaf Trot. But, you know, just to get the Breeders' Crown under our belt is a great accomplishment, so. I know the temptation was there to race her in the net ring against the boys. Are you glad you didn't? Yeah, you know, in hindsight now she's 7-for-7, seven seven, so hopefully she keeps it going and we can uh, meet up again with, in, the Maple, in the Maple Leaf Trot, so. Look forward to seeing her then. Congratulations, Dwayne. Go get your picture Thanks. taken. You earned it. Thanks, Ken. And he waited long enough for it as well. Foil in her first two tries in the Breeders' Crown. She gets it done here tonight, and she does it in style. Peaceful way, the Mare Trial winner here on Breeders' Crown Night. In the winner's circle to Ken Middleton. That coverage, an interview with winning trainer Dave Tingley, as seen live and nationally on the Score television show. Mare from Royal Bait. Bred and co-owned by Angie Stiller of Arva, Ontario. Co-owners Marvin Katz, Al Libfeld, Sam Goldband, and Going My Way Stable. Trained by Dave Tingley. Undefeated in seven this year now. That's her first Breeders' Crown title. She is the track record holder here at Mohawk and holds a share of the world record. And now wears the crown. The Breeders' Crown, presented in the winner's circle by Dr. J. Glenn Brown. 